What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Hugo Strange. Um, I've been sick these past couple of days, uh, which is why I'm wearing my bathrobe. Um, so excuse me there that I didn't clean myself up for this video, but uh, I just felt it necessary to make this video now while it's still fresh in my mind and while um, I still have my, uh, my faculties to talk about it. Um, for those of you who don't know, there's this uh, bill uh, going on right now called SOPA, um, the Stop Online Piracy Act and the Protect IP Act, uh, PIPA. Anyway, um, I don't know if anybody's been um, keeping up on, on that lately. Uh, and if you are watching this video and if you're uh, a YouTuber online, you really should uh, do some research on that and look into it. Um, here's what's going on. The, the SOPA bill is basically a vaguely worded bill that is made to stop online piracy. The problem with the bill and that a lot of internet reviewers such as myself and uh, the people at Channel Awesome and uh, other reviewing websites, the problem with the bill is that the wording is very vague and it eliminates due process for people to defend their content. Not only that, but it is a blanket uh, it is a blanket um, basically it stops it, it blacklists the website basically what I'm saying is this if if one person on YouTube has a video on YouTube that is infringing on a copyright and and based on the language in the soap act it could be just accused. Understand something, the simple accusation that it's infringing on a copyright. It may not actually be infringing on a copyright, but the simple accusation that it is can delist the entire website. Not just that person's account anymore. Understand, not just that person's account. That person's account won't just be shut down. I'm talking about the entirety of YouTube being shut down for one video that may or may not be infringing on a copyright. Just all it takes is just for a studio executive to point and say, that's infringing, and YouTube's gone. You know? Just like that. And and if you think that can happen, if you're if you're a YouTube partner or somebody, you know, thinking, well that will never happen, they won't do it like that, it just won't happen. Uh, yes, it will. The, the bill is worded that vaguely to the point where an action like that can take place. Uh, in the same fashion, uh, it eliminates the due process, meaning there is no longer a warning that says, you know, you need to take this content down or, you know, face legal action. No more of that. Just, if it's infringing, it's gone. Not just your account, all of YouTube. And like I said, the way the bill is worded right now, yeah, all of YouTube can be potentially shut down. That means all of your partners are gone. Anything you're doing on YouTube, done, over. Um, same thing with other video channels, Blimp, Vimeo. Um, any video channel where people are posting videos could potentially be delisted and gone for good, never coming back. Um, and this is a scary thing, considering that there are a lot of upstart YouTubers, such as uh, Larry Williams of Otaku Assemble, Ziploc Gory, who've just recently got their partnership and are still reaping the benefits of that, and it would be a shame to cut that short, um, because a lot of these things are, a lot of these uh, partnerships and things like that are stimulating the economy, are creating new jobs. And places like Google, Blip, Vimeo, all of these corporations that, you know, generate video content that are web-based could potentially be shut down based on this bill. So it's not just a thing to stop online piracy. Understand, 
there are jobs at stake thousands of jobs and not just you know not just me wanting to make my little videos and whatnot not just that anymore there are a lot of legitimate people who will lose their jobs if this thing goes if this thing passes through and uh, basically what I'm telling you all to do is to write your congressman get involved and don't feed me you know the cynical BS of you know, oh, we don't have a voice. Oh, they're gonna pass it anyway. Oh, this will never pass. The thing is, if we don't say something, then yes, it will. And you will only have yourself to blame for it. You know, uh, there isn't much that I can do. I've written my congressman. I've called twice. Um, you know, I've been sick the past couple of days, so there isn't much I can do. I can't even, like, go to work right now. Um... And yeah, I understand I'm making a video, but trust me, uh, for the physical activity that I have to do at work, I'm in no condition to do that. So I'm urging you, you know, write your congressman, call, you know, get involved. Get involved. If there's nothing else that you haven't gotten involved in, if you enjoy watching videos on YouTube, if you enjoy, you know, watching videos elsewhere, Get involved, because this affects you. This doesn't just affect you. This affects a lot of people out there, a lot of legitimate jobs out there, a lot of people like myself, a lot of people like Zip, a lot of people like, you know, all of the YouTubers on here who are adhering to the DMCA, who are in, you know, the confines of fair use. You know, all it takes is them. You know, all it takes is, is you know, our voices to be heard and whatnot. And I know that's such a cliche a cliche thing to say but think of this you could have a potentially different internet by next year where there is no YouTube and there is no you know other videos websites out there where you know there are no longer a place where you can watch a trailer for a movie where there are no more people online reviewing movies you could potentially have a different internet and in Entirely different internet um, and that's scary understand something the people who are the proponents of the SOPA bill are the same people who were who spoke out against VHS tapes and reruns on television things of that nature and you know those those were killed but this SOPA bill seems to be moving very thoroughly. Uh, I just watched the live feed uh, last night where they were voting on a couple of amendments to clean up the language in the bill. And a lot of those amendments were voted down. A lot of really legitimately good amendments that would narrow the focus of SOPA to internet pirates and, you know, foreign websites that are aiding internet piracy. Uh, a lot of those amendments were shot down. Meaning they're keeping SOPA as broad as possible to include people like you, to include people like me, and, you know, other websites that, again, are in the confines of fair use. I'm talking about things like Let's Plays, trailer reviews, movie reviews, things like Dexterity, things of that nature. All of it could be gone just because of this SOPA bill. So, I'm urging you, write, call... A couple of links are below to help you do this and whatnot. Just get involved. Like, for the sake of, just not you, but just for the sake of, like, a bunch of jobs out there, get involved. You know? Stop sitting on the sidelines. Anyway, that's all I have to say. And, again, I'm sorry that I'm not, you know, um, um, dressed for this but uh i just feel like i needed to make this video uh now and you know keep generating content for my uh for my channel um so that'll do it for me uh get involved links are below i'm out peace